Hey lovies, it's your girl Jojo and I am back for another video and I am so excited because I just came back from our Jaren Berry conference. Um, the last video I posted was the highlights. It was amazing. I had the most amazing, phenomenal time. I've learned so much. I was, I'm so inspired and just ready to kill it. Um, I am going to win a trip to Puerto Vallarta. I'm speaking it into existence, I'm claiming it, and I'm just so excited. And we got some new products. It, the launch date is August 1st, so you as a consumer can buy it August 1st. But because I came to conference, I was able to buy it early, so I'm super excited. So I wanna show you, I have a combination of wraps. I'm gonna do this hand so I can show you all. Um, and I just wanna do this video, so this way you'll learn how to apply wraps. You'll learn how to um, use our new Color Cure product. Um, and yeah, all that good stuff. So this is what my manicure looks like. I thought that was super cool. It's like a holographic butterfly. Look at the shimmer. I love it. So, um, yeah, I want you to join me. Um, so the very first thing you're going to do when you're using Jamberry and you're applying wraps is you always wash your hands well, and I've done that. Um, and then you want to push back your cuticles. So I always recommend using our Jamberry cuticle remover. It's like a pin and I am wearing wraps on my thumb and my middle and my pinky. So I'm going to do it. Well, actually I'm going to do this on every step, on every finger, but um, especially when you're wearing your wraps, um, you want to make sure you push back all of that cuticle. Um, so I'm going to take an orange stick and I have a, I don't know where I put it. I have our deluxe toolkit and there is a, supposed to be a metal spoon pusher, but I used it for my other hand. So I don't know where I put it, but I used the metal spoon pusher and this to clean my cuticles. And basically you're just taking it and you're just pushing back. Um, so you can get all that nasty cuticle off. And yeah, um, doesn't take very long, but you don't want to skip this step. You want to get it really good. And most people have what they call invisible cuticle. And so you just want to make sure you're getting it all good. All right, I am back. My nails are prepped and I am ready to use my wraps. Now, usually you could use one whole side of a sheet uh, for one manicure, but I have longer nails. So I tend to have to dip into both sides of my sheet. But usually a sheet gives you um, two manicures and two pedicures. The biggest ones are for your toes. So you'd cut, I have a big toe. So I would cut this one in half and then this one into eights. Most people cut this one into eights and this one into half. Um, and then you'll use the rest for your fingers. You This is another important step. So prep is probably the most important. The second most important is sizing. You wanna make sure you have a wrap that fits and you should theoretically have a slither of nail showing. Let me put this closer. So you see a little slither that's showing um, and that's because if the wrap is too big, it's not gonna stay. And if it's sticking to your skin, that's not good. It should not touch your skin. It should be perfectly adhered. Um, right below like the base of your cuticle and you should have a slither of skin on the side um, that means you've applied it correctly you've used the right side um, no one is going to look at your nail from the side if they do they're weird no <laughs> just kidding um, but yeah so that is how you use our nail wrap so anyways without any further ado let's go ahead and get into step two all right so now I know I'm gonna do my thumb you never want to touch the wrap with your fingers because your fingers have oils and the oils can mess up the adhesive. So what I like to do is kind of get it started and then use a little orange stick or scissors or tweezers or whatever I have handy and I'll open it. This is Jamberry's mini heater. You need this in your life. 
you can use a blow dryer, but blow dryers tend to get either really hot or not hot enough. Not to mention the fact that this has a kickstand, so it stands up. So, you're going to take the wrap, and let me try to turn it around without touching it. <laughs> there we go. You're gonna take the wrap, you're going to place it at the base of your fingernail. So it's like that, at the base. Then, once I have it on pretty good and it's adjusted well, I'm gonna start to add pressure. My thumb, you guys see that? Then I'm going to heat it. So I used to heat it first, but I learned that once I heat it, it gets gooey, it adheres. And if I messed up and had to take it off and re-adjust like adjust it, I'm gonna cut this part so I don't mind touching it. Um, I like to pull it just to shape it perfectly to my nail. Uh, but what I was saying is like, if I messed up and it had already heated, it was like really, it just looks crazy. It looks um, really crazy and that, you know, I just was like, ah, I shouldn't have heated it first. So now I heat after. So you go middle, heat, then you go to the side, right side, heat, pressure, left side, heat, pressure, and it should be on there again really well. Then I stretch and heat as well. So I know where I'm gonna file that off. And that wrap is on there pretty good to my um, skin. I'm gonna cut the excess off. And then I'm gonna take my file at a 90 degree angle and file the excess off. It really comes off. I am going to cut a little piece on the side off because that's not where my nail is. And then I go back and heat it again for good measure. And that, ladies, is how you apply the Jamberry Nail Wrap. Okay, so this is how you apply Color Cure. I'm so excited about this product. So you're gonna take the color that you want to apply. The great thing about this product is there's no base coat or no top coat needed. So you'll take the color you want and you'll apply a very thin coat, very thin. It should be half of what you use for our True Shine Gel. Um, we also have a color corrector pin coming out in August. So if you make mistakes, you can just clean up the cuticle with that. So you'll take a thin layer, you'll uh, put your hand in, and I'll do that in a second here, and then you'll take it out uh, once it stops, and then you'll apply another thin layer. It's really great and it's so convenient not having a base or a top coat. And it has three intervals. So unlike um, True Shine, which is 45 seconds, this cures at 99 automatically. But if you were, say you were only doing wraps and you wanted a clear coat, you don't need 99 seconds. You can put it on 30 or 60. Um, so you have the choice. And after it, um, you remove your hand, you wanna let it set in natural light or not necessarily natural light, it could be the lighting in your house, whether it's dark or light, as long as the light is on, so that it polymerizes on its own. And you don't have to wipe off any residue like our True Shine, so it's really cool. Really, I'm just like so in love with this. And they came out with 10 colors at conference. We're getting 20 colors all together. It just cut off. So I'll take it out, and there you have it, beautiful. I just wanted to show you our new Color Gear collection coming August 1st. If you want to get a pre-order on this, hit your girl up. I will uh, link all my info in the description box. Also, if you wanna get paid to have pretty nails like me and have the dopest time of your life, the dopest job ever, hit me up because I am looking for boss babes like myself to join me. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and pretty nails.